One of the advantages of Produktronika is to meet nice colleagues and I have one occasion here to meet such a nice colleague. I'm here on the Viscom booth with Mr. Detlef Beer. Hello Detlef, nice to meet you. Hello, nice yeah. to meet you too. Just for safety reasons, can you introduce the company Viscom and his profile? Yes, of course. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, my name is Dietlef Beer. I'm responsible here as a head of the product development for Complete Viscom. And Viscom is, uh, I think, one of the yeah, leader in the automatic inspection mm -hmm. for optical and X-ray systems in the electronic industry. We are here on the Productronica show. So, how is your impression so far about the show, about being again here? Yeah, so we are really yeah, uh, it's quite nice to be here and uh, there are really, really a lot of um, visitors coming here. They are very interested in the part and we have the feeling if somebody is coming to the show, then he is, uh, uh, needs new information and he has good questions. So that is really high quality uh, talks here. So we are there's satisfied a, so far. Yeah. There's a lot of interest. Yes, yeah, of yeah, course. Yeah, you can yeah. really feel it. Yeah. Detlef, on our booth there is this automation line where there is a Wiscom AOI at the end of the line. There are many uh, solutions with, with the Wiscom AOI. How was this project and how was the integration of the Wiscom AOI? In that, uh, yeah, so um, yeah, we are the a part of the uh, process expert uh, solution and um, that was really a very good collaboration. I think we started uh, two years ago. and. Um, there was at the beginning a uh, discussion about which interface mm -hmm. do we use. And, uh, and then after some discussion, we decided uh, to use uh, the CFX interface as, as a basement. And I think that was a very good decision. Yeah, so that we have here a global standard uh, which we use uh, for transfer of the data. And on this uh, development then, yeah, we are uh, integrated our AOI systems um, yeah, um, to the process expert solutions. and. I think then really after some weeks we started already then the first on-field tests yeah, on customer side which has also been then yeah, a good cooperation yeah, to, uh, to getting here and the, the updated and uh, the improvements uh, for these interfaces. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, I think one challenge part was really um, the amount of data. So I mm -hmm. think that was a part where a little bit then also the ask um guys have been uh, surprised yeah, how many data is generating the AOI. Yeah. Uh, so uh, after the first field test, uh, there was a little bit of traffic jam, I would say, yeah, where uh, we transferred so many data that they have to queue up the data and uh, to improve then their uh, um, data pipeline. But after this has been finished, then yeah, I think it works this quite well. Smooth, yeah. 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 Uh, so speaking of data, and I also heard before, some of your customers are asking for uh, artificial intelligence presentation. So how is it with artificial intelligence here? Yeah, artificial intelligence, it is really uh, a very important point, and, um, but it's not, I would say, the solution for everything. Yeah? Um, so, it is, uh, for me, it's a little bit more like an additional sensor technology, where you have to keep the data, uh, train modules, and uh, to use um, this, uh, this feedback um, in these cases, but at the end, really, yeah, you're just getting a confidence value yeah, from the artificial intelligence, and you must really uh, uh, put this together with standard results and very important is also that you keep a transparency yeah, uh, of, of the data flow and everything. Yeah? So that is really also very important. Uh, in your field there's a word uh, zero escape. So what is that and how can you realize that? Or is it realizable? Yeah, zero escapes that, uh, is a, one of the main important things. So uh, when you're running a, yeah, a high quality production um, so that's nearly not allowed to have any escapist product at the end of the line. So when you are yeah, in the automotive business, when you're in the, uh, in the space parts, yeah, there will be really, really everything 100% perfect. Yeah? And here it's important that um, you have really, um, yeah, we call it a closed loop, which is common from the uh, technology for the printer, to also integrate it as a closed loop function to the AOI and the X-ray system. So that you, when you catch any defects, yet you still know that you are also keep these defects captured also in the future and you always improve it on the right way and so that you not uh, make a fine tuning on one side and you uh, get lost on the other side. Yeah? And here really we need special technologies. Our technology here we call it is this uh, integrated verification where we keep the data, we keep the history and using this data for updating and improve the test parts.
Yeah. Yeah. And also this feedback is in, again used also for the AI solutions, yeah, because we have here the knowledge of the defects, and we also use this knowledge to verify and test the AI solutions, so that we have also then the feedback that this is working, and then we can mix the results from the AI together with the standard uh, parts, and uh, to have here the best benefit. Interesting, interesting solution. So we are here on your booth, it's very crowded. What is the highlight of Wiscom at Productronica? The highlight is really that we are, uh, see that there's more and more interest uh, and demands on inline EXI solutions. And uh, yeah, I think there was a history going that 3D SPI is now inline and is a standard approach, 3D AOI is standard. And I think the next generation is 3D X-ray in line. Yeah? And uh, so we have here now really solutions where we uh, can do it also in the cycle time demands of a production line. We have here uh, uh, large new FPD technologies, high speed uh, capturing technologies available, uh, which can do really inline 3D slicing and 3D inspection for, for voids, for uh, THT fillings and so on. I have one last question for our viewers. What is your recommendation when someone starts now to uh, invest in a new AOI? What, what should he consider? What are points to consider? I think here it is important um, that you uh, must separate two, uh, two points. The one point is really that you get the return of invest yeah, that you need when you have an uh, and invest yeah, that you know yeah, okay, that you can speed up the process, yes, uh, you have uh, the possibility to reduce human power yeah, to uh, uh, work there more cost uh, efficient. But on the other hand, you also have uh, to see a look at, at your quality. Yeah? And that is much more difficult, yeah? Uh, yeah, what costs quality yeah? and when you have a quality improvement. And that is hard uh, to understand or how to make it valuable. Yeah? Uh, but there is the main benefit of the inspection technology. Uh, so you must really uh, go deep inside, uh, analyze your process, and you can really getting not only the uh, decisions is this okay or not okay, because the inspection system really creates your processing ongoing data that you can really evaluate and uh, and see how is your process going. Uh, At and, the end, uh, improve, yeah. Yeah, so that is important. And that is the, the part where you uh, will get the benefit a little bit later. Yeah? Do not get it directly. Yeah? So that is really difficult to get it as a direct return of invest, but that is uh, really, really uh, important for the future. And here it's really important that you keep this in mind and that you also go in the step. Yeah? And that needs a little bit also then uh, in, yeah, uh, work together uh, with um, the, the new user of the systems and, yeah, and us. Thank you very much, Detlef. That was very interesting. I wish you a successful Prototronica and I'll see you then maybe over to our booth on the automation line. Thank you. Yeah, thank you very much. It was a pleasure.